616 is your time right now. And as we enter March, Women's History Month takes center stage, or as we like to call it, Women's Herstory Month. The contributions of women is celebrated every day at a museum in Fort Worth. And NBC 5's Deborah Ferguson was there this week to get a sneak peek at a new exhibit showcasing the women keeping alive a centuries old sport. Fort Worth is home to the only museum in the world dedicated to telling the story of women who helped shape the West. A new exhibition celebrates daring cowgirls beyond the border and the women here inspire to carry on the tradition. For close to 50 years, the National Cowgirl Museum and Hall of Fame has championed cowgirls of all backgrounds and lifted women from the shadows of history. Uno, dos, tres, a new multi-gallery exhibition in the museum will tell a story that stretches into Mexico and the national sport of Escaramuza Chara, the only female equestrian event in the Mexican rodeo Charreria. The first gallery includes textiles, adorned dresses, and tack. Portraits and poems will be in a connecting gallery. Escanamusa Chata has been on my mind as a topic to explore for many, many years. It's Diana Vela's job to curate the stories told in the museum's galleries, and inspiration for this one came in part from her late father. Lo and behold, 15 years ago, my father had sent me an email that said, you should look at Escanamusa Chata for a uh, potential exhibition. Escaramusa Chata is an event uh, that is in the Mexican rodeo, and it consists of a team of eight women who perform synchronized maneuvers at a gallop, also while wearing these incredible dresses and sitting side saddle. And this is an official competition dress. The exhibit features breathtakingly beautiful dresses handmade in Mexico and stitched according to the strict rules of rodeo competition. The thread that is used there is called pita. The thread in the handmade saddle came from an agave plant. The plant is taken apart and the fibers dried in the sun. The stirrup, everything on here is, um, you know, just beautifully crafted. Modern day Escaramuzas trace their roots back to the 1900s. And the Adalitas, or Soladaderas, the gritty and determined women fighters during the Mexican Revolution. Centuries later, their bravery, strength, and horsemanship live on in a woman from Washington State who is the U.S. ambassador for Escaramusa, and in women in North Texas, like Tierra Azteca from Midlothian. So the greater mission of the Calgary Museum is always lifting up those voices who are not always heard. And this is a perfect exhibition for us. These are incredible horsewomen who work hard, they're passionate, and you don't really get to hear about them very much, and you don't get to, to see them very much. Our tagline is the women who shape the West, change the world, and that's certainly true with the Escaramusa Chata in the way that they are spreading their sport, their culture, and their heritage. They are truly changing the world. This new multi-gallery exhibition called Soldaderas to Amazonas Escaramusas Charas will open on March 22nd and then run through December. The Calgary Museum wants to make this exhibit accessible, so everything in it is bilingual. Deborah Ferguson, NBC5.